Hi, welcome to Touring on a Bicycle or Homeless Survival Camping Skills on Facebook and YouTube. Somebody today asked me after I ordered a new Big Agnes Encampment 15 degree sleeping bag um, 2018 version versus this Big Agnes Encampment 15 degree sleeping bag that is 2012 it's been remodeled it is this is a regular uh, it takes a regular sleeping pad 72 by 20 by 2 inches and up in a sleeping bag sleeve and hold on a second okay back to the sleeping bag this is the back side of the sleeping bag you can see my big Agnes I'm in my uh, Thermarest Trail Pro sticking out of the sleeve and I'll be right back as I come around to the other side. Well, here's how the uh, 2012 sleeping bag pad goes into the Big Agnes. And the 2017 and 2018 has been remodeled. I'll make a video on that. But somebody asked me today, why can't I just go to Walmart or Big Five or Dick Sporting Goods and buy myself an inexpensive sleeping bag? Well, this is rated right 15 degrees. As you can see, it has a sleeping pad sleeve. It's your installation. This pad, I mean, this sleeping bag is three pounds, four ounces for the regular. And it's packed 8 by 18. And would you want to bike tour in the Pocono Mountains and North New York from Syracuse to Scranton, Pennsylvania, then to the Pocono Mountains? And, you know, it's high elevation. Um, I grew up in the Poconos, and I grew up in the Northwest New Jersey. Even the uh, altitude in northwest New Jersey on my plan of a bike touring trip in 2019, uh, probably May or June. But my backup plan is the southern tier bicycle route from Tampa, Florida to San Diego, February of 2020. Well, mountain range there is goes over the continental divide. I would not want to use a heavy sleeping bag or sleeping pad on that route. And this is a Big Agnes encampment, 15 degrees from 2015. I mean, 2012. Okay, here's the top part folded over. But this here don't hook up here because the Velcro is coming undone. But... Thermarest remodeled the uh, Trail Pro sleeping pad and hold on a second. I'll show you the reason. This is the inside. So this is really paper thin right here. And you can see the 2012 ended up getting a hole. But you need an R value of 4.0 and higher. To match a 15 degree sleeping bag from Big Agnes for the sleep system. So this is why I ordered the Big Agnes 2 track sleeping pad that is 72 inches long, 20 inches wide, 2 inches thick. But I'll be will I will be ordering a Nemo tensor field insulated sleeping pad from REI in April with my 20% discount and my dividends, whatever they are. And I really highly recommend um, the Big Agnes encampment sleeping, sleeping bag. And I kind of recommend the two-track, but it doesn't compact really small. It's like five inches. 
by 21 on the 72 by 20 by 2 inches and it's 1.75 pounds. The Big Agnes encampment is um, 3 pounds 4 ounces and packed 8 by 18 or 19 the last time I remember. Thanks for watching this video. And most people don't understand why some people like lighten their load um, for bicycle touring. I'm not bike packing, so I really don't really need to lighten my load. I don't like down sleeping bags. This is a synthetic. I'll be able to wash it in a machine and have and keep it clean. Um, here's the top side. And... Uh, there's a real good sleeping bag. There's the old label. And uh, Big Agnes, I highly recommend them. I've been talking to them by email about repairing this. They told me it would be cheaper just to replace this sleeping bag by just buying a new one. It would have cost me to ship this back and get it repaired. Uh, Y'all have a good day, whatever you're doing. If you're homeless or you're bike touring, y'all have a safe day.